All right, y'all, peace. We got to fill in the blank, show. Life family, chosen ones, advanced ones, you know what I'm saying? You know, it's fine and dandy that we're figuring out the truth in the corporeal realm, which is the physical realm. This is all by the will and help of the creator, also assigning certain angelic forces around you. Angelic forces, as explained, is those who already live a corporeal life, a mortal, a mortal life, and transitioned already and you know became their butterfly and it's an everlasting butterfly so with this right now it's very important for you to be able to master your your spirituality your physical nature you know what i'm saying and your mental nature you know because consciousness lasts after death you know what i mean even the memory of you lasts you know until it's faded between the mugs who lived with you or had you in their heart you know unless it's just preserved on as history you know but other than that it's preserved on the akashic that we say or the light the light book and the light book is inside of you you know you're naturally occurring if you're a naturally occurring species then yeah you're pure blood but those who are not naturally occurring and they can tell that they're a little hybridish you still have the source in you you have to tap into that part i know and understand that yo you may hate parts of yourself because you know of the genetic makeup and also the frequency that you may be existing on and this is just for also for anyone who's just even if you're pure blood you know what i'm saying you still you still gonna you still have this frequency around because it's been you know pushed out on earth for us to you know observe and see and also to be gaslighted and projected upon us this is also important why you have to study the cluster B personality disorder. And we're gonna get real deep into that because as a species, people has mastered us due to our cluster B personality. And they have it, so they gaslighted and projected it onto us, you know? So this is a, we're gonna get into that. We're gonna get into that as, as a species, you know what I'm saying? As a people and as a, just, uh, just as a whole. Because Nagas, it can't be like this forever where Nagas get unfair treatment. I don't care what you say, they got unfair treatment. We look at the history, we see, didn't get compensated for nothing. And money really can't pay for none of that, you know? And we know that money, these people walk around like money gonna save they ass, and it really don't, you know? So it, it just feeds the ego on being able to do things in the physical, corporeal world to get. But once an individual start honoring their own being and their natural living and their life force, they won't be just subjected to money anymore like that. They'll utilize it as a tool, but it won't be as a lustful thing for them, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, it's very important, you know? to understand that the, the cosmology, the birds, the Leahy, who, the, the emperor, cardinal, all that is all around, you know what I'm saying? Those are angelic forces as well. So you tap into those forces, you gotta get by yourself. Me, I'm just out here, boom, 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 doing what it do. In the early rising, I'm gonna go get it in. I usually don't go into the gym like that, uh, but I have been because I had a membership. But I'm about that joint now, man, because we finna go ahead and get right back to nature. You really don't need too much of them. You're utilizing their money and this transfer, the energy with their faces on the mud. How egotistical is that? There's no face with a Naga on there. I don't care. You can got an Africa, African Naga or whatever, but they ain't no African nation came to help no Naga over in the Maruka. So yeah, it's important for you. And if the, the you know, the, the European-ish, um, you can say Caucasians, you want to help and add on to the truth? Well, yeah, you can definitely just donate and just, you ain't got to worry about give good energy, but just have great intent. And donate to someone who's reasonable that you know is going to get that shit done. All right, with that being said, I love y'all. Peace, and I'll be with you in the next one.